Senegal listen, Wolof, Senegal, French, Senegal, officially the Republic of Senegal Wolof, Rewam Senegal, French, République du Senegal, is a country in West Africa. Senegal is bordered by Mauritania in the north, Mali to the east, Guinea to the southeast, and Guinea-Bissau to the southwest. Senegal also borders the Gambia, a country occupying a narrow sliver of land along the banks of the Gambia River, which separates Senegal's southern region of Casamance from the rest of the country. Senegal also shares a maritime border with Cape Verde. Senegal's economic and political capital is Dakar. The unitary semi-presidential republic is the westernmost country in the mainland of the Old World, or Afro-Eurasia, and owes its name to the Senegal River, which borders it to the east and north. The name, Senegal, comes from the Wolof, Hall, which means, our boat. Senegal covers a land area of almost 197,000 square kilometers, 76,000 square miles, and has an estimated population of about 15 million. The climate is typically Sahelian, though there is a rainy season. Topic: <laughs> Cultures and influences. The territory of modern Senegal has been inhabited by various ethnic groups since prehistory. Organized kingdoms emerged around the 7th century, and parts of the country were ruled by prominent regional empires such as the Jolof Empire. The present state of Senegal has its roots in European colonialism, which began during the mid-15th century, when various European powers began competing for trade in the area. The establishment of coastal trading posts gradually led to control of the mainland, culminating in French rule of the area by the 19th century, albeit amid much local resistance. Senegal peacefully attained independence from France in 1960, and has since been among the more politically stable countries in Africa. Senegal's economy is centered mostly on commodities and natural resources. Major industries are fish processing, phosphate mining, fertilizer production, petroleum refining, construction materials, and ship construction and repair. As in most African nations, agriculture is a major sector, with Senegal producing several important cash crops, including peanuts, sugarcane, cotton, green beans, tomatoes, melons, and mangoes. Owing to its relative stability, tourism and hospitality are also burgeoning sectors. With it being a multi-ethnic and secular nation, Senegal is predominantly Sunni Muslim with Sufi and animist influences. French is the official language, although many native languages are spoken and recognized. Since April 2012, Senegal's president has been Macky Sall. Senegal has been a member of the Organisation Internationale de la Francophonie since 1970. History. Early and pre-colonial eras Archaeological findings throughout the area indicate that Senegal was inhabited in prehistoric times and has been continuously occupied by various ethnic groups. Some kingdoms were created around the 7th century, Takrur in the 9th century, Namandiru and the Jolof Empire during the 13th and 14th centuries. Eastern Senegal was once part of the Ghana Empire. Islam was introduced through Tukular and Saniki contact with the Almoravid dynasty of the Maghreb, who in turn propagated it with the help of the Almoravids, and Tukular allies. This movement faced resistance from ethnicities of traditional religions, the Surahs in particular. In the 13th and 14th centuries, the area came under the influence of the empires to the east. The Jolof Empire of Senegal was also founded during this time. In the Senegambia region, between 1300 and 1900, close to one-third of the population was enslaved, typically as a result of captives taken in warfare. In the 14th century the Jolof Empire grew more powerful, having united Kair and the kingdoms of Baol, Sine, Saloum, Wallo, Feuda Toro and Bambouk, or much of present-day West Africa. The empire was a voluntary confederacy of various states rather than an empire built on military conquest. The empire was founded by Indiadian Engi, a part Surer and part Tukular, who was able to form a coalition with many ethnicities, but collapsed around 1549 with the defeat and killing of Lele Foley Fak by Amari Ngoni Sobel Fall. <laughs> Colonial era 
In the mid-15th century, the Portuguese landed on the Senegal coastline, followed by traders representing other countries, including the French. Various European powers—Portugal, the Netherlands, and Great Britain—competed for trade in the area from the 15th century onward. In 1677, France gained control of what had become a minor departure point in the Atlantic slave trade. The island of Gore next to modern Dakar, used as a base to purchase slaves from the warring chiefdoms on the mainland. European missionaries introduced Christianity to Senegal and the Casamance in the 19th century. It was only in the 1850s that the French began to expand onto the Senegalese mainland after they abolished slavery and began promoting an abolitionist doctrine, adding native kingdoms like the Wallo, Caer, Baol, and Jolof Empire. French colonists progressively invaded and took over all the kingdoms except Sine and Saloum under Governor Louis Faderbe. Euro Dyao was in command of the canton of Fos Galagina and was set over Wallo by Louis Faderbe, where he served as a chief from 1861 to 1914. Senegalese resistance to the French expansion and curtailing of their lucrative slave trade was led in part by Lot Dior, Damel of Caire, and Maad a Synod Kumba en Dauphine Famic Juf, the Maad a Synod of Sine, resulting in the Battle of Logandame. Independence On 4 April 1959 Senegal and the French Sudan merged to form the Mali Federation, which became fully independent on 20 June 1960, as a result of a transfer of power agreement signed with France on 4 April 1960. Due to internal political difficulties, the federation broke up on 20 August, when Senegal and French Sudan renamed the Republic of Mali each proclaimed independence. Léopold Sédar Senghor was Senegal's first president in September 1960. Senghor was a very well-read man, educated in France. He was a poet and philosopher who personally drafted the Senegalese national anthem, Pincez tous vos chorus, frappez les balafons. Pro-African, he advocated a brand of African socialism. In 1980, President Senghor decided to retire from politics. The next year, he transferred power in 1981 to his hand-picked successor, Abdou Diouf. Former Prime Minister Mamadou Dia, who was Senghor's rival, ran for election in 1983 against Diouf, but lost. Senghor moved to France, where he died at the age of 96. In the 1980s, Boubacar Lam discovered Senegalese oral history that was initially compiled by the Tukulor noble, Yoro Diao, not long after World War I, which documented migrations into West Africa from the Nile Valley. Ethnic groups, from the Senegal River to the Niger Delta, retained traditions of having an eastern origin. Senegal joined with the Gambia to form the nominal Senegambia Confederation on 1 February 1982. However, the union was dissolved in 1989. Despite peace talks, a southern separatist group Movement of Democratic Forces of Casamance or MFDC in the Casamance region has clashed sporadically with government forces since 1982 in the Casamance conflict. In the early 21st century, violence has subsided and President Macky Sall held talks with rebels in Rome in December 2012. Abdou Diouf was president between 1981 and 2000. He encouraged broader political participation, reduced government involvement in the economy, and widened Senegal's diplomatic engagements, particularly with other developing nations. Domestic politics on occasion spilled over into street violence, border tensions, and a violent separatist movement in the southern region of the Casamance. Nevertheless, Senegal's commitment to democracy and human rights strengthened. Abdou Diouf served four terms as president. In the presidential election of 1999, opposition leader Abdoulaye Wade defeated Diouf in an election deemed free and fair by international observers. Senegal experienced its second peaceful transition of power, and its first from one political party to another. On 30 December 2004 President Wade announced that he would sign a peace treaty with the separatist group in the Casamance region. This, however, has yet to be implemented. There was a round of talks in 2005, but the results have not yet yielded a resolution. Politics Senegal is a republic with a presidency. The president is elected every five years as of 2001, previously being seven years, by adult voters. 
The first president, Léopold Sédar Senghor, was a poet and writer, and was the first African elected to the Académie Française. Senegal's second president, Abdou Diouf, later served as general secretary of the Organisation de la Francophonie. The third president was Abdoulaye Wade, a lawyer. The current president is Macky Sall, elected in March 2012. Senegal has more than 80 political parties. The unicameral parliament consists of the National Assembly, which has 150 seats a Senate was in place from 1999 to 2001 and 2007 to 2012. An independent judiciary also exists in Senegal. The nation's highest courts that deal with business issues are the Constitutional Council and the Court of Justice, members of which are named by the President. Political culture Currently, Senegal has a quasi-democratic political culture, one of the more successful post-colonial democratic transitions in Africa. Local administrators are appointed and held accountable by the president. Marabouts, religious leaders of the various Muslim brotherhoods of Senegal, have also exercised a strong political influence in the country especially during Wade's presidency. In 2009, Freedom House downgraded Senegal's status from free to partially free, based on increased centralization of power in the executive. However, it has since recovered its free status by 2014. In 2008, Senegal finished in 12th position on the Ibrahim Index of African Governance. The Ibrahim Index is a comprehensive measure of African governance limited to sub-Saharan Africa until 2008, based on a number of different variables which reflect the success with which governments deliver essential political goods to their citizens. When the Northern African countries were added to the index in 2009, Senegal's 2008 position was retroactively downgraded to 15th place with Tunisia, Egypt and Morocco placing themselves ahead of Senegal. As of 2012, Senegal's rank in the Ibrahim Index has decreased another point to 16 out of 52 African countries. On the 22nd of February 2011, Senegal reportedly severed diplomatic ties with Iran, saying it supplied rebels with weapons which killed Senegalese troops in the Casamance conflict. The 2012 presidential election was controversial due to President Wade's candidacy, as the opposition argued he should not be considered eligible to run again. Several youth opposition movements, including M23 and Yin Amar, emerged in June 2011. In the end, Macky Sall of the Alliance for the Republic won, and Wade conceded the election to Sall. This peaceful and democratic transition was hailed by many foreign observers, such as the EU as a show of maturity. On 19 September 2012, lawmakers voted to do away with the Senate to save an estimated $15 million. Administrative divisions Senegal is subdivided into 14 regions, each administered by a Conseil Régional regional council elected by population weight at the arrondissement level. The country is further subdivided by 45 départements, 113 arrondissements neither of which have administrative function and by collectivités locales, which elect administrative officers. Regional capitals have the same name as their respective regions. Foreign relations Senegal has a high profile in many international organizations and was a member of the UN Security Council in 1988-89 and 2015-2016. It was elected to the UN Commission on Human Rights in 1997. Friendly to the West, especially to France and to the United States, Senegal also is a vigorous proponent of more assistance from developed countries to the Third World. Senegal enjoys mostly cordial relations with its neighbors. In spite of clear progress on other fronts with Mauritania border security, resource management, economic integration, etc., an estimated 35,000 Mauritanian refugees of the estimated 40,000 who were expelled from their home country in 1989 remain in Senegal. Senegal is part of the Economic Community of West African States ECOWAS. Integrated with the main bodies of the international community, Senegal is also a member of the African Union and the Community of Sahel-Saharan States. Military 
The Senegalese armed forces consist of about 19,000 personnel in the Army, Air Force, Navy, and Gendarmerie. The Senegalese military force receives most of its training, equipment, and support from France and the United States. Germany also provides support but on a smaller scale. Military noninterference in political affairs has contributed to Senegal's stability since independence. Senegal has participated in many international and regional peacekeeping missions. Most recently, in 2000, Senegal sent a battalion to the Democratic Republic of Congo to participate in MONUC, the United Nations peacekeeping mission, and agreed to deploy a United States trained battalion to Sierra Leone to participate in UNAMSIL, another UN peacekeeping mission. In 2015, Senegal participated in the Saudi Arabian-led military intervention in Yemen against the Shia Houthis. Law Senegal is a secular state, as defined in its constitution, to fight corruption. The government has created the National Anti Corruption Office and the Commission of Restitution and Recovery of Illegally Acquired Assets. According to Business Anti Corruption Portal, President Saul created the OFNAC to replace the Commission Nationale de Lutte contre la non transparence, la corruption et la concussion. It is said that the OFNAC represents a more effective tool for fighting corruption than the CNLCC established under former President Wade. The mission of OFNAC is to fight corruption, embezzlement of public funds, and fraud. OFNAC has the power of self-referral own initiative investigation. OFNAC is composed of 12 members appointed by decree. Homosexuality is illegal in Senegal. According to 2013 survey by the Pew Research Center, 96% of Senegalese believe that homosexuality should not be accepted by society. Geography <laughs> <laughs> Senegal is located on the west of the African continent. It lies between latitudes 12 degrees and 17 degrees north, and longitudes 11 degrees and 18 degrees west. Senegal is externally bounded by the Atlantic Ocean to the west, Mauritania to the north, Mali to the east, and Guinea and Guinea-Bissau to the south. Internally it almost completely surrounds the Gambia, namely on the north, east and south, except for Gambia's short Atlantic coastline. The Senegalese landscape consists mainly of the rolling sandy plains of the western Sahel which rise to foothills in the southeast. Here is also found Senegal's highest point, an otherwise unnamed feature 2.7 km southeast of Nepandiaka at 648 feet). The northern border is formed by the Senegal River, other rivers include the Gambia and Casamance rivers. The capital Dakar lies on the Cap Vert Peninsula, the westernmost point of continental Africa. The Cape Verde Islands lie some 560 kilometers, 350 miles off the Senegalese coast, but Cap Verde, Cape Green, is a maritime placemark set at the foot of Les Mammals, a 105 meter, 344 feet cliff resting at one end of the Cap Verde peninsula onto which is settled Senegal's capital Dakar and 1 kilometer, 0.6 miles south of the Point des Almadies, the westernmost point in Africa. Climate Senegal has a tropical climate with pleasant heat throughout the year with well-defined dry and humid seasons that result from northeast winter winds and southwest summer winds. The dry season December to April is dominated by hot, dry, harmattan wind. Dakar's annual rainfall of about 600 mm occurs between June and October when maximum temperatures average 30 degrees Celsius degrees Fahrenheit and minimums 24.2 degrees Celsius .6 degrees Fahrenheit. .December to February maximum temperatures average 25.7 degrees Celsius .3 degrees Fahrenheit and minimums 18 degrees Celsius .4 degrees Fahrenheit. .Interior temperature 
temperatures are higher than along the coast for example, average daily temperatures in Kaulik and Tambakunda for May are 30 degrees Celsius .0 degrees Fahrenheit and 32.7 degrees Celsius .9 degrees Fahrenheit respectively, compared to Dakar's 23.2 degrees Celsius .8 degrees Fahrenheit, and rainfall increases substantially farther south, exceeding 1,500 mm in annually in some areas. In Tambacounda in the far interior, particularly on the border of Mali where desert begins, temperatures can reach as high as 54 degrees Celsius .2 degrees Fahrenheit. The northernmost part of the country has a near-hot desert climate, the central part has a hot semi-arid climate and the southernmost part has a tropical wet and dry climate. Senegal is mainly a sunny and dry country. Environment Topic <inaudible> Economy After its economy contracted by 2.1% in 1993, Senegal instituted a major economic reform program with the support of international donors. This reform began with a 50% devaluation of the country's currency, the CFA franc. Government price controls and subsidies were also dismantled. As a result, Senegal's inflation went down, investment went up, and the gross domestic product rose approximately 5% a year between 1995 and 2001. The main industries include food processing, mining, cement, artificial fertilizer, chemicals, textiles, refining imported petroleum, and tourism. Exports include fish, chemicals, cotton, fabrics, groundnuts, and calcium phosphate. The principal foreign market is India with 26.7% of exports as of 1998. Other foreign markets include the United States, Italy and the United Kingdom. Senegal has a 12 nautical mile 22 km, 14 miles exclusive fishing zone that has been regularly breached in recent years as of 2014. It has been estimated that the country's fishermen lose 300,000 tons of fish each year to illegal fishing. The Senegalese government have tried to control the illegal fishing which is conducted by fishing trawlers, some of which are registered in Russia, Mauritania, Belize and Ukraine. In January 2014, a Russian trawler, Oleg Nadanov, was seized by Senegalese authorities close to the maritime border with Guinea-Bissau. As a member of the West African Economic and Monetary Union WAEMU, Senegal is working toward greater regional integration with a unified external tariff. Senegal is also a member of the Organization for the Harmonization of Business Law in Africa. Senegal achieved full internet connectivity in 1996, creating a mini boom in information technology based services. Private activity now accounts for 82% of its GDP. On the negative side, Senegal faces deep seated urban problems of chronic high unemployment, socio economic disparity, juvenile delinquency, and drug addiction. Senegal is a major recipient of international development assistance. Donors include the United States Agency for International Development, USAID, Japan, France, and China. Over 3,000 Peace Corps volunteers have served in Senegal since 1963. Demographics Senegal has a population of around 15.4 million, about 42% of whom live in rural areas. Density in these areas varies from about 77 inhabitants per square kilometer 200 per square miles in the west central region to 2 per square kilometer 5.2 per square miles in the arid eastern section. Ethnic groups Senegal has a wide variety of ethnic groups and, as in most West African countries, several languages are widely spoken. The Wolof are the largest single ethnic group in Senegal at 43%, the Fula and Tukulur also known as Halpalorin, literally, Pular speakers. 24% are the second biggest group, followed by the Surer 14.7%, then others such as Jola 4%, Mandinka 3%, Moors or Narkadjurs, Saniki, Basari and many smaller communities 9%. See also the Bedic ethnic group. 
about 50,000 Europeans mostly French and Lebanese as well as smaller numbers of Mauritanians and Moroccans reside in Senegal, mainly in the cities and some retirees who reside in the resort towns around Mbour. The majority of Lebanese work in commerce. The country experienced a wave of immigration from France in the decades between World War II and Senegalese independence. Most of these French people purchased homes in Dakar or other major urban centers. Also located primarily in urban settings are small Vietnamese communities as well as a growing number of Chinese immigrant traders, each numbering perhaps a few hundred people. There are also tens of thousands of Mauritanian refugees in Senegal, primarily in the country's north, according to the World Refugee Survey 2008, published by the US Committee for Refugees and Immigrants. Senegal has a population of refugees and asylum seekers numbering approximately 23,800 in 2007. The majority of this population is from Mauritania. Refugees live in Indium, Dodal, and small settlements along the Senegal River Valley. <laughs> <laughs> Languages French is the official language, spoken at least by all those who enjoyed several years in the educational system that is of French origin Quranic schools are even more popular, but Arabic is not widely spoken outside of the context of recitation. Most people also speak their own ethnic language while, especially in Dakar, Wolof is the lingua franca. Pular is spoken by the Fulas and Tukular. The Surah language is widely spoken by both Surahs and non-Surahs including President Saul, whose wife is Surah, so are the Kanjan languages, whose speakers are ethnically Surahs. Jola languages are widely spoken in the Casamance. Several of the Senegalese languages have the legal status of national languages. Balanta Ganja, Hassaniya Arabic, Jola Phoni, Mandinka, Manjak, Mankanya, Noon, Surah Noon, Pular, Surah, Saniki, and Wolof. Portuguese Creole, locally known as Portuguese, is a prominent minority language in Ziguinchur, regional capital of the Casamance, spoken by local Portuguese Creoles and immigrants from Guinea-Bissau. The local Cape Verdean community speak a similar Portuguese Creole, Cape Verdean Creole, and Standard Portuguese. Portuguese was introduced in Senegal's secondary education in 1961 in Dakar by the country's first president, Leopold Setter Senghor. It is currently available in most of Senegal and in higher education. It is especially prevalent in Casamance as it relates with the local cultural identity. French is the only official language in the country, but a backlash in the form of a rising Senegalese linguistic nationalist movement supports the integration of Wolof, the common vernacular language of the country, into the national constitution. Senegalese regions of Dakar, Diorbel, Fadak, Kafrin, Kaulik, Kedugu, Kolda, Luga, Matam, St. Louis, Sedu, Tambacounda, Tees and Ziguinchur are members of the International Association of Francophone Regions. <laughs> <laughs> Largest cities Senegal's capital of Dakar is by far the largest city in Senegal, with over 2 million residents. The second most populous city is Touba, a de jure communote rural, rural community, with half a million. <inaudible> Religion Senegal is a secular state. Islam is the predominant religion in the country, practiced by approximately 92% of the country's population. The Christian community, at 7% of the population, are mostly Roman Catholics, but there are still diverse Protestant denominations. 1% have animist beliefs, particularly in the southeastern region of the country. Some Surah people follow the Surah religion. A majority of the Muslims in Senegal are Sunni with Sufi influences. Islamic communities in Senegal are generally organized around one of several Islamic Sufi orders or brotherhoods, headed by a caliph Zalifa in Wolof, from Arabic Khalifa, who is usually a direct descendant of the group's founder. The two largest and most prominent Sufi orders in Senegal are the Tijaniya, whose largest subgroups are based in the cities of Tivawan and Kaulik, and the Muridiya, Murid, based in the city of Touba. 27% are non-denominational Muslims. The Halpalar Pular speakers, composed of Fula people, a widespread group found along the Sahel from Chad to Senegal, and Tukulars, represent 23.8% of the population. Historically, they were the first to become Muslim. 
Many of the Tukulars, or sedentary Halpilar of the Senegal River Valley in the north, converted to Islam around a millennium ago and later contributed to Islam's propagation throughout Senegal. Success was gained among the Walafs, but repulsed by the Surahs. Most communities south of the Senegal River Valley, however, were not thoroughly Islamized. The Surah people stood out as one of this group, who spent over 1,000 years resisting Islamization see Surah history. Although many Surahs are Christians or Muslim, their conversion to Islam in particular is very recent, who converted on their own free will rather than by force, although force had been tried centuries earlier unsuccessfully see the Battle of Fandan Thioyuthun. The spread of formal Quranic school called Dara in Wolof during the colonial period increased largely through the effort of the Tijaniya. In Murid communities, which place more emphasis on the work ethic than on literary Quranic studies, the term Dara often applies to work groups devoted to working for a religious leader. Other Islamic groups include the much older Qadiriya order and the Senegalese Layin order, which is prominent among the coastal Labu. Today, most Senegalese children study at Dara's for several years, memorizing as much of the Quran as they can. Some of them continue their religious studies at councils majlis or at the growing number of private Arabic schools and publicly funded Franco-Arabic schools. A modern messianic sect in Islam, the Ahmadiyya Muslim community is also present in the country which represents approximately 1% of the Muslim population. Small Roman Catholic communities are mainly found in coastal Surah, Jola, Moncanya and Balant populations, and in eastern Senegal among the Basari and Kaniyagi. The Protestant churches are mainly attended by immigrants but during the second half of the 20th century Protestant churches led by Senegalese leaders from different ethnic groups have evolved. In Dakar Catholic and Protestant rites are practiced by the Lebanese, Cape Verdean, European, and American immigrant populations, and among certain Africans of other countries as well as by the Senegalese themselves. Although Islam is Senegal's majority religion, Senegal's first president, Léopold Sédar Senghor, was a Catholic surer. Surah religion encompasses a belief in a supreme deity called Rug, kooks among the Kanjan, Surah cosmogony, cosmology and divination ceremonies such as the annual XOY or Khoi ceremony presided over by the Surah Saltigs high priests and priestesses. Senegambian both Senegal and the Gambia Muslim festivals such as Tabaski, Gamo, Korida, Wari Kor, etc., are all borrowed words from the Surah religion. They were ancient Surah festivals rooted in Surah religion, not Islam. The Bokout is one of the Jola's religious ceremonies. There are small numbers of adherents of Judaism and Buddhism. Judaism is followed by members of several ethnic groups, while Buddhism is followed by a number of Vietnamese. The Baha'i faith in Senegal was established after Abdul Baha, the son of the founder of the religion, mentioned Africa as a place that should be more broadly visited by Baha'is. The first Baha'is to set foot in the territory of French West Africa that would become Senegal arrived in 1953. The first Baha'i local spiritual assembly of Senegal was elected in 1966 in Dakar. In 1975 the Baha'i community elected the first national spiritual assembly of Senegal. The most recent estimate, by the Association of Religion Data Archives in a 2005 report details the population of Senegalese Baha'is at 22,000. Health Life expectancy by birth is estimated to 57.5 years. Public expenditure on health was at 2.4% of the GDP in 2004, whereas private expenditure was at 3.5%. Health expenditure was at $72 PPP per capita in 2004. The fertility rate ranged 5 to 5.3 between 2005 and 2013, with 4.1 in urban areas and 6.3 in rural areas. As official survey, 6.4 in 1986 and 5.7 in 1997 point out. There were six physicians per 100,000 persons in the early 2000s decade. Infant mortality was at 77 per 1,000 live births in 2005, but in 2013 this figure had dropped to 47 within the first 12 months after birth. In the past five years infant mortality rates of malaria have dropped. According to a 2013 UNICEF report, 26% of women in Senegal have undergone female genital mutilation. Education. 
Articles 21 and 22 of the Constitution adopted in January 2001 guarantee access to education for all children. Education is compulsory and free up to the age of 16. The Ministry of Labor has indicated that the public school system is unable to cope with the number of children that must enroll each year. Illiteracy is high, particularly among women. The net primary enrollment rate was 69% in 2005. Public expenditure on education was 5.4% of the 2002 to 2005 GDP. Topic: Culture Senegal is well known for the West African tradition of storytelling, which is done by griots, who have kept West African history alive for thousands of years through words and music. The griot profession is passed down generation to generation and requires years of training and apprenticeship in genealogy, history and music. Griots give voice to generations of West African society. The African Renaissance Monument built in 2010 in Dakar is the tallest statue in Africa. Dakar also hosts a film festival, Rasidic. Topic: Cuisine. Because Senegal borders the Atlantic Ocean, fish is very important. Chicken, lamb, peas, eggs, and beef are also used in Senegalese cooking, but not pork, due to the nation's largely Muslim population. Peanuts, the primary crop of Senegal, as well as couscous, white rice, sweet potatoes, lentils, black-eyed peas and various vegetables, are also incorporated into many recipes. Meats and vegetables are typically stewed or marinated in herbs and spices, and then poured over rice or couscous, or eaten with bread. Popular fresh juices are made from bisap, ginger, bai pronounced bui, which is the fruit of the baobab tree, also known as monkey bread fruit. Mango, or other fruit or wild trees most famously soursop, which is called corosol in French. Desserts are very rich and sweet, combining native ingredients with the extravagance and style characteristic of the French impact on Senegal's culinary methods. They are often served with fresh fruit and are traditionally followed by coffee or tea. <laughs> Music Senegal is known across Africa for its musical heritage, due to the popularity of M. Balax, which originated from the Surer percussive tradition especially the Nuip. It has been popularized by Yusu Endur, Omar Payne and others. Subar drumming is especially popular. The subar is mostly used in special celebrations like weddings. Another instrument, the tama, is used in more ethnic groups. Other popular international renowned Senegalese musicians are Ismael Lowe, Sheikh Lowe, Orchestra Baobab, Baba Mall, Akon Theon Sec, Vivian, Titi and Pape Diouf. <laughs> Cinema <laughs> Media Hospitality Hospitality, in theory, is given such importance in Senegalese culture that it is widely considered to be part of the national identity. The Wolof word for hospitality is Taranga, and it is so identified with the pride of Senegal that the national football team is known as the Lions of Taranga. Sport Senegalese play many sports. Wrestling and football are the most popular sports in the country. Senegal will host the 2022 Summer Youth Olympics in Dakar, making Senegal the first African country to host the Olympics. Topic: <laughs> Wrestling. Wrestling is Senegal's most popular sport and has become a national obsession. It traditionally serves many young men to escape poverty and it is the only sport recognized as developed independently of Western culture. Football Football is a popular sport in Senegal. 
In 2002, the team finished as runners-up at the Africa Cup of Nations and became one of only three African teams to ever reach the quarter-finals of the FIFA World Cup, defeating holders France in their first game. Popular players of Senegal include El Haji Diouf, Khalilo Fadiga, Henri Kamara, Papa Bouba Diop, Salif Diao, Ferdinand Kohli, and Sadio Mane all of whom played in Europe. Senegal also qualified for the 2018 FIFA World Cup in Russia, playing in Group H alongside Japan, Colombia and Poland. <laughs> Basketball Basketball is also a popular sport in Senegal. The country has traditionally been one of Africa's dominant basketball powers. The men's team performed better than that of any other African nation at the 2014 FIBA World Cup, where they reached the playoffs for the first time. The women's team won 19 medals at 20 African championships, more than twice as many medals as any competitor. In 2016, the NBA announced the launch of an elites academy in Africa, and more precisely in Senegal. Topic. Motorsport The country hosted the Paris-Dakar Rally from 1979 until 2007. The Dakar Rally was an off-road endurance motorsport race which followed a course from Paris, France to Dakar, Senegal. The competitors used off-road vehicles to cross the difficult geography. The last race was held in 2007, before the 2008 rally was cancelled a day before the event due to security concerns in Mauritania. See also Outline of Senegal Index of Senegal-related articles <laughs>